Former 90 Day Fiancé franchise star Karen Martins used Instagram to convey a very important message about her and Paul Stell's kids, who are currently not in the couple's custody. Brazilian woman Karen first appeared on TLC via the spin-off 90 Day Fiancé. Before the 90 Days Season 1. After having met Karen online, Paul traveled to her home to see her in person. Fans saw Paul and Karen struggle with a language barrier and trust issues, but they still got married in November 2017, after which their problems have seemingly tripled. Karen moving to the States spelled doom for her relationship with Paul, and in December 2021, the couple appeared to have split for good. In their four years of marriage, Paul and Karen have both managed to make a bad impression on fans. TLC viewers anticipated that the couple could lose custody of their kids after an alleged video of Karine pulling Paul by the hair and forcibly holding him to the couch in front of their eldest son Pierre surfaced online. Paul blamed Karine for putting their then-infant boy Ethan into the front seat of a car in another video. Karine was reportedly arraigned in March 2022 on allegations of domestic violence. In July this year, Paul went missing, along with Pierre, who is now three years old. Paul did return home to Kentucky on July 3 after a police report filed them as missing since June 9. He gave his son to his parents and claimed he didn't want to face child protection services. Paul's parents seemed to have then contacted CPS who took Paul and Karine's son Pierre to the foster home where their younger son Ethan is. The couple did end up losing custody after the damaging videos had been posted on the internet. Amidst a scary situation, however, Karine has been staying mum. In her newest Instagram story, Karine wrote that her children are in fact her top priority. 90 Day Fiancé celeb Karine claimed that she misses her sons every minute. She wrote that she's doing everything she can to get them back. But, the catch is that Karine is just not allowed to talk about it. She then added a message to her haters. If you don't believe that then f you. Karine wrote bluntly. The same message was posted in Portuguese by the TLC star. Reddit user UBUDMACK21 shared Karine's statement with other fans, and in the discussion, many viewers agreed that they really feel for Karine. User Toaster Guacamolera padded how Karine might not be perfect, but she's also not the first vulnerable woman to lose custody of her kids after years of abuse from a known FWAD. Fans recalled how Karine and Paul had started talking when she was just 17 years old, which means she's never known an adult life without Paul, as per Wild Beach 1995. Many believe that Karine is indeed trying her best to get her kids back, but she is smart to not announce her plans on social media. Just because she is a 90 Day Fiancé star doesn't mean that Karine should let her followers know about everything that's going on in her life. Every time Karen posts anything about herself, including videos of her doing makeup, which she probably learned in her cosmetology classes, she gets a barrage of hate comments. Karen's well-wishers hope she's able to get custody of her children so she can go back to Brazil, away from reality TV husband Paul and the drama from her past. Source, Karen Martin's Instagram, UBUDMACK21 Reddit, U Toaster Guacamole Rep Reddit, UWILDBITCH1995 Reddit.